We begin with the sticky hot temperatures. Yeah. If you've been outside at all today, you know what I'm talking about. It was hot. Mm -hmm. Right now, there is a heat advisory in place for Northeast Ohio until 9 p.m. Here's a live look out east at Fairport Harbor Beach. It's a perfect day to cool down in some cool water. Yes, absolutely. And things are heating up over at Cedar Point. We are just days away from the park's big announcement on what's next for the old top thrill dragster. So we'll have that for you on Tuesday. Uh, but with that, we turn our uh, attention to Jason Michael with the forecast and uh, some more pop up storms that maybe are on the way. Yeah, that's right. Hi, Jay. How are you? Hey there, guys. We have no short order in terms of alerts for Northeast Ohio on this Friday afternoon. Tropical feels outside right now. Dew point temperatures still elevated in the 70s for many. So this is what it looks like for your next four at four. Temperatures in the mid to low 80s right now, slowly progressing down into the mid to upper 70s. But there's a caveat, though. We're expecting more showers and thunderstorms to move through overnight tonight. And and the frontal boundary is still miles and miles away. So in fact, with those showers and thunderstorms moving through overnight tonight, we now have a new flood watch in effect until about 8 a.m. for us on Saturday morning. Look at all of the counties included in this. So we're expecting really, really some downpours there, but also a little bit of good news. We're, uh, we have allowed our heat advisory to expire across the area. We're only keeping a couple counties still in Northeast Ohio under that, including Mahoning County. Air quality issues still interbound across the area as well. Elevated dew point temperatures, elevated humidity, elevated particles in the atmosphere. We're going to keep that in effect at least until about midnight, including Cuyahoga County, Lake Geauga, Summit, Medina, and even Portage County again until midnight. With the renewed threat for some showers and thunderstorms overnight tonight, we'll keep that confined to our eastern areas and that'll likely happen past the midnight hour. You can see for our counties shaded here in the yellow. So all of us will be sort of radar antennas up as the heat is continuing across many, many states over the Midwest. But we do get a break that arrives for us late Saturday into Sunday and Sunday is mwah, picturesque. We'll talk about those conditions coming up. Oh, we love that, Jason. Thank you so much. We know that you'll keep us up to date on the storms that are passing through this afternoon. Thank you.